Hi, Bregan Jamison here with CDOC. Today I'm going to show you guys how to go about uh, changing a PM4, which is mounted, which is what we use for our uh, tank and toolbar. Um, they're like our nodes. Um, so what you want to do, if you have a faulty PM4 that you found, you can unplug the power, uh, plug in the new PM4, and of course mount it. And then you're going to want to come into here, and you're going to want to go into your settings. And you're going to see PM4 replacement. And it has a 1 beside it. So if you click on that. And it's already notified that something. Um, there's one that is not there anymore. And a new one recognized. So you're going to want to go PM4 replacement. So the unmap. The new one that you just plugged in is here. The located with the serial number. And the one that you, uh, that you figure is faulty. Is over here. You want to make sure that the serial numbers are correct. And if they are. You go down to here and go next. In here, you can do a perform test, and it's a light test, and it'll give you step-by-step -step procedure here. So if you hit that, you'll have a, a light test that'll go to the new one, and it'll do a quick uh, test on the new PM4. After that, you just go next. And if you want to replace the, the new one with the old one, you just hit replace, and you're done. And that's how easy it is to change a PM4, whoop, just like that and the PM4 is replaced and you can get back to your seating right away. And back to your operate screen, 